Hey you guys, welcome back to another video brought to you by the one that was too much fun. That's a bit better. Where should I stand, honey? Welcome back to the video brought to you by the one and only Simone Nicole TV. And that's on what? That's on period poo. So I am in Indianapolis and I'm gonna be taking you guys with me to um, a black owned restaurant today, tonight. Um, I just got to work not too long ago. I'm gonna go ahead and get in the shower. I'm wearing a towel right now. I'm gonna go get in the shower, but I just wanted to come and do an introduction to the video. I'm trying my best to vlog. This was not planned. My my boo bear, my papa bear, <laughs> my buck boo. He um said that he's gonna take me out tonight, and he's just gonna surprise me with a night out. So we gonna go out, and I'm gonna take you guys with me. So I'm gonna record here and there, and I really want to make sure I make more videos regarding black-owned establishments because. There's not enough videos on YouTube about it, to be honest. And I love going to them when I can find them in the city. So I just want to promote and help you all find them too. So I'm going to go ahead and get in the shower and I'll be back. Talk to you guys once I um, turn you to my makeup. It's a very nice restaurant. I already showed me the, um, the link and everything. It's called Michael Jazz, Michael Soul Food, something like that. Um... But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and I don't know what I'm wear because I'm not prepared to be going out. Like most of you guys know, I travel for work and I sent most of my going my date night clothes. Well, they were date night. I sent most of my date night clothes out. So I'm about to work with what I got. I got a couple little pieces I can still make make something shake, but we'll see. But y'all, I popped my nail. So I'm gonna have to like get some nail glue or something and put the thing back on. This happened today. Let me tell y'all how this happened. I was trying to get in here, but from the back. So I was like digging, trying to get to my scalp. <laughs> it just popped off. It didn't even hurt though, which I'm surprised. I think it's because it's the type of um, tip they use. They use the clear one. Usually I go to salons and I don't use the clear one. This is my first time getting clear tips. And of course you paint it over it because this is the type of design I wanted. They were so cute, but it is around the time for me to get a new set, to be honest, because it's, it's growing out for one. Can y'all see? It's growing out. And the color, the white is not as white as it used to be. It's becoming more of a beige color, but it's not noticeable to the, to the naked eyes. It's noticeable to me because I know how it looked before. But yeah, I'm going to try to fix that. We'll see. But yeah, y'all, I was trying to get in. I was trying to get in there. I was doing all this and then boom. <laughs> Off. I said, did my nail just pop? And I looked. And for about, I want to say five minutes, I didn't know where the nail was and it was still in there. So I had to pull it out and I still have it. So I'm going to try to glue it back on. But we'll see. But like I said, I'll talk to y'all once I finish getting dressed. Bye. Hey, you guys, you can't really see me. Okay, you see me a little bit right here. So we're in the car. We're heading to the restaurant now. Just checking in. Um, they didn't have any more tables left, so we're gonna try to see if we can get to the bar. We're gonna see. And I'll show you guys once we get there. Bye. Oh, I didn't get the nail fixed, y'all. So I'm walking in this restaurant with my missing nail. My homegirl she kid was gonna bring me some glue, but I ain't have enough time to go get the glue from her. <laughs> so, but I mean, I was able to do my makeup and put clothes on, didn't do my baby hairs, but it's gonna be all right. I think it's gonna be kind of dim in there maybe i don't know it doesn't matter as long as we're enjoying ourselves and we actually get a spot at the bar it's really all that matters but yeah i will see you guys when we get there
Okay, so I had, what did I say? I have no complaints. The food was so good. I didn't get the itis, but I feel content. I had the salmon, fontaloni, fontalane, and I had mashed potatoes, and it had skin in it, and it was good, it was seasoned. I had some cabbage, the cabbage was on point. It was better it was better than the Jamaican cabbage because I hate the Jamaican cabbage but they're making it too crunchy. But the cabbage here was like mama's cabbage. What else I have? The three sides. Um oh the yams are so good. It wasn't too sweet. It wasn't my auntie's yams, but it was still good. Shout out to Auntie Celeste and my mama Karen. And then Juwan had some baked chicken, which was really good, and it had some corn. I didn't taste your corn, was it good? It was good. And then I, he had some um, macaroni. macaroni cheese. It was good. Was there enough cheese on it? Okay, there was enough cheese on it. We'll see. Was that it? The third item. Something else. I can't yeah. remember. Oh, the greens was good too. I didn't even see any meat in it. Was there meat in it? Which was even better because I don't like. Eat, I don't eat turkey and I don't eat beef. I don't eat uh, pork. So it was still good without having chunks of meat in it. But the band was really nice. The guy who was performing, he was definitely giving church. Like, it felt like we were supposed to need to be in there. <laughs> need to be in there, you know. If he was in their family, like, they was at church. But it was a little warm, which I'm not mad at because I don't like being cold. I'm, a, I'm slightly anemic. But um, it was a really good time. I enjoyed myself. It was phenomenal. The band, the food, no complaints. Um, the pictures online make it look more spacious than it really is. But that's okay. It was still a nice venue. And it was black owned, so I really enjoyed myself tonight. Thanks to my baby. Did you enjoy yourself? I did. <laughs> and I'm gonna go ahead and close up the vlog. By this point, you have seen other clips of our night, and we're gonna head back. Oh, we also had some drinks. I had Moscato, and I had one night stand, and it had Tito's in it, I think. Juan had the same thing, but instead of the wine, he had one night stand and um, a sweet tea. It tastes like lips and sweet tea. That's what it tasted like. It's still good, but it wasn't really sweet, was it? Thank you guys for watching my video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Make sure you shop black owned. Make sure you spend your coins at black owned establishments because why not? Bye. No tea, no time to cry, just